Well, hello, everybody. Look at me, 8.45 p.m., making a video. Small miracles, they happen. I've had a tragedy. Can you see it? It's a tragedy. A real tragedy. I caught it on the seatbelt or something. I don't even really, like, I don't really know what I did. But I know how to fix it. So if it was not way below my skin line, I'd probably just trim it back. But because it's below my skin line, it's not going to happen. Alright, so I have a bag of tea. It doesn't matter what flavor. <laughs> no, for this to work, you have to have matcha meat grapefruit. <laughs> I don't drink tea, but my daughter does. And apparently, the whole bag is adult proof. Okay, so Mmm, smells good. It smells really good, actually. Alright, sorry, I had to have a sip of coffee. Okay, so what you're doing here, and I'm gonna try not to wreck her whole bag because she'll just throw it in one of her little loose leaf containers or whatever and still use it. You just want. Also got my camera super up close for you guys, so hopefully you can see good. Like all these little pieces fall, and this is enough to fix about 100 nails. Okay, so I'm cutting a very little piece off. And I'm going to need my tweezers. These aren't the ones I want. Yeah, these are the ones I want. I want the super sharp ones. Like, these cheap ones I got at Walmart, and I thought they were super sharp. They are not. In comparison, they are not. I like the super sharp ones much better. Okay, so I removed the polish. Washed my hands. Now... Taking a base coat, doesn't matter what you guys, Keratin 3 Day Growth Nail Aid is what I'm using. Are you kidding me? <laughs> this is the kind of day I'm going to have. My nail broke. <laughs> My polish remover top came off. What in the hell? Oh my god. Okay, hang on. I know I can fix it. <laughs> Oh, that was too much for my day. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just going to, and I'm going to do the whole nail with a base coat just because I want, you know, one layer on there. And now I'm taking our tiny friend here. And laying him out on the nail. And then... Now, Smusher, world's best tool. He's just going to help me get it arranged. Arrange it. And you just got to kind of... I feel like I need something. I need something. I don't know what. How about a bottle of Night all? That'll work. Yep, there. Now I can make it so my hand isn't moving. I mean, my doll is good for so many things. <laughs> now we know. Okay. And this won't, like, 
stick to it and get all craptastic or anything. Okay, so we've got that laid down there. And like a, a good, you know, fairly quick drying top coat is what you want. I actually debated using the gel, but it that gel is not quick drying by any means. And I've got my little sticks here to just because I am, I am going heavy-ish on that base coat. So I want to make sure I'm also kind of cleaning it up so I don't just end up with a big layer of junk on the side. And this end that I never use, that little cuticle nipper and clear and cutter end works good too. And you're just kind of pushing it in a bit. Helping it get sticky stucky. And the idea is to get that little piece over. Little tea bag piece over as much as you, you can get it. Now it's getting pretty, pretty good and sticky. And I'm not just adding more layers to the whole finger, just to this part. Okay, you can probably hear the bunny chewing behind me. She got a new... <laughs> Why is it funny to me to say that the rabbit got a new enrichment toy? But she did. And it's like, um, pressed Timothy Hay, uh, shaped like a little tube and then they put um, more Timothy Hay inside it but it's like super duper hard to chew what they is what they need because their teeth never stop growing so they need to work them down especially ones that live in the house all right I need another sip of coffee okay so see that little bit I've got over the edge it'll be fine we'll take care of it so, there we go. My doll bottle has saved the day. Now I had a twosie of Poppy That. Ugh. Beautiful set. Haven't used it yet, but I feel like it's going to work. I, I, I feel like, I mean, come on, you guys. It's perfect with this set. Like, geez, really? Okay. And... This is not all the way dry. It's like not all the way set up. But it's okay. Oh no. Okay, hang on. Stick it back on the smooth side. I feel like that strip might not be quite, quite wide enough for me. So I'm going to add this one to this side because it doesn't really matter. And I will say, oh, this is a very pretty set. I'm going to have to use that pretty soon. Um, I do not think that that nail would have broke if it had two layers of color street on it or was a glitter like I mean day by day has glitter in it but it's a very sparse glitter right like a really soft sparse gold beautiful but had that been <coughs> <coughs> sorry guys had that been um, like this kind of glitter you know a full on glitter or had I put the thanks a million over it. I don't think that would have happened. 
I'm I don't have my nails break low often at all and part of it is because I always have like two plus layers of color straight on okay so now oh, I don't want to get this these are I really do think that the as sticky as things are lately is because um it's so warm out and we're like humid and stormy I sure today okay so now that I have this over it I can really focus more on getting it squished down because I'm not going to be you know it's not sticky now it's got color street on it okay but because I don't want anything to happen to it I'm using the other half of that same strip I'm making a wrinkle dang it oh yeah there we go move it might all oh yeah there we got that wrinkle oh, good. okay so I put two layers on here and you really part of it has even a spare layer get off there a little teeny bit of purple and I'm glad I put that over there because definitely it wasn't wide enough to make the whole the whole trick So the video I posted of this set, Marcy's like, hey, I liked your new camera angle. <laughs> well, I didn't. I mean, I noticed it, but I don't know why it did it. I had set my camera up exactly the same as I always do, and for some reason it just went wonky. I don't know. And I'm not technical, you guys these videos don't get edited like if something went so awry while I was making it I just wouldn't post it or I mean it would have to be super awry for me not to post it because I'm not too worried I figure if you've really taken offense to something you'll shut it off right okay so the only thing I will not do um, for a few hours or maybe till tomorrow is I won't file it so you know I'm going to change these tomorrow anyway but I have enough layers of this um, three-day growth on there now that even when I use the remover jar it'll still leave my tea bag there and it will leave enough top coat over it and then I'll just keep reply reapplying the top coat um, until this is long enough that I can cut it back, you know, without cutting down in the skin. Because, uh, even the thought of that gives me heebie-jeebies. But that blended in just perfectly fine and dandy. Good call. Good call. So there we go, you guys. That is how you fix a break. I mean, I don't think you can tell by any means that I have done you know some surgery there I think it looks great so there we go hope that can help somebody out and I'll see you guys probably either tomorrow night or Saturday night for some fresh nails I'm doing a little uh, nod to color street this go around and um, hopefully a little take on the galaxy nails so we'll see we'll see how it turns out hope everybody has a good one